In this video, we'll demonstrate installing the USB drivers on Windows XP for the Ease Enhanced Vehicle Interface, EVI 6000. This will apply to both the cable and wireless versions of the EVI 6000 when installing on Windows XP. What you're going to do is take your vehicle interface, again it applies to both the wireless and cabled versions of the EVI 6000 and we're going to connect the USB cable to a USB port on your PC. When will you have to install these drivers? If this is the first time you are connecting your USB vehicle interface to the PC you're going to be using the scan tool on, then you will see a found new hardware wizard appear. You will see this wizard again if you reinstall the scan tool or connect your vehicle interface to a different PC. If you do not see the found new hardware wizard, then you already have a suitable USB driver installed on your PC. Connect one end of your USB cable to the PC you'll be using the scan tool on and connect the other end to your vehicle interface. When you do, you'll see a found new wizard button pop up in the bottom right hand corner or a little window and then you'll see the found new hardware wizard appear. On the first screen, it's going to look for drivers and search. Just say no, not at this time. Click next. At this point, we're going to install the Ease Vehicle Interface USB device drivers says what do you want the wizard to do? Select the first option, install the software automatically. Click Next. On Windows XP you may see a Windows logo testing screen pop up just like this. If you do, simply click Continue anyway. It's going to finish installing the USB device drivers. When it's done, click Finish. You'll see Found New Hardware in the bottom right hand corner. And again, you may see the found new hardware wizard appear again. If it does on your PC, that's okay. We're going to have to install yet another driver. So we're going to repeat the process. Simply click, no, not this time. Click next. Now we're going to install a different device driver. It says Ease Vehicle Interface USB Serial Port. Okay, same option as before. What do you want the wizard to do? Install the software automatically. Click next. If you see the logo screen appear, simply click continue anyway. It's going to finish installing the drivers. At the end, click finish. And that's it. Your vehicle interface, your EVI 6000, is now all set up to use. And you see that in the bottom right hand corner. It says your hardware is installed and ready to use.